Greg, you knew it was going to be a grind. You said that's the style they play, it's the style you play. So at game's end, what eventually put you guys over the top? Uh, what we did defensively, how we were able to get stops, and then the rebounding. We were able to get to, on the offensive glass, which helped us manufacture just enough offense. Not, it wasn't pretty, but uh, at this time of year, you're just trying to find a way to survive in advance. How do you manage the guys' frustrations? Make sure that nobody goes outside of their lanes when you struggle the way you did in the first half especially. Well, I thought our guys did a good job. I thought our bench pick, picked us up. We got a boost from Charlie Thomas on the glass, and we didn't panic or we didn't flinch at the point when it was 12-3 to 3 and we, we couldn't find the basket. You know, if we were in a boat, well, we couldn't find any water. So um, you know, just had to keep stay with it, not flinch, not panic, and keep grinding away. And we got to the free throw line, which helped us too. And then obviously the second half defensively, we were able to tighten the screws a little bit more. Um, and then obviously get on the offensive class. I know you're trying to look ahead now, but as we look back three months, you're an assistant coach on a team that's struggling. Now you're the head coach of a team that just won an NCAA tournament game. How far has this team come in that three month span? Well, I told him after the game here that I don't know if three months ago there could have counted on their defense to win any games. Uh, so how they've matured and how they've grown, and obviously we'll get the ball to go in. And we've shown that we can score at times, but every time we every time we played them, whether it's been in the NCAA tournament or in, in series that we've had with them, it's always been a grinder. Two teams that play very physical, two teams that are very defensive oriented, and you just try to find enough, make enough plays to be able to come out on top. Now a very short time to enjoy this one before you guys prepare for the winner of the game about to happen right now. Yeah, we'll uh, get some rest here tonight and start preparing later tonight as soon as we find out who wins. Greg, truly appreciate the time. Congrats on the win. All right, thank you. Let's go back to Chicago, guys.